Jacob Edward Drew. I'll be performing the model of Jim from a play that I don't know about. Uh, <laughs> so, what do I say to start? See, the neighborhood's been bad. It's been bad ever since I can remember. We've been planning to move for a long time, but my dad lost his job. And well, it just hasn't been possible. But even though we live in a rough area where drug deals go down on every corner, we've stayed clear of the problem, free of those people and their habits. We know what happens if we get into crack, marijuana, ice, any of the substances. Bobby, my sisters, and I, we've, we've kept clear of the streets. We've, tr we've always tried better than that, <laughs> than that, because of our parents, because of their concern for us, and teaching us about the importance of staying out of trouble and getting a proper education. I'm a straight A student, so was Bobby. He was, one of, he was at the top of his class, an honor student, one of the smartest guys you'd ever want to meet, a real neat person. Everybody liked him a lot. That's what's so shocking about him getting shot. I mean, if he'd been involved with drugs, involved with gangs, you might understand why he might come to some trouble. But a guy like Bobby, it was also crazy. Me and Bobby were walking along minding our own business when this car appears out of nowhere. And this other car cuts it off, slams into it. These guys pile out of the car and onto the street. They all have guns. They get into a huge argument. They start screaming and calling each other names. Then this one kid challenges this guy from the other car, and the guy shoots him, just like that. The other guy started blasting away, and before long it was like a war out there. With homes, families. That's when Bobby got it. I'm hip, he said. They hit me. I turned to see him holding his stomach. At first I didn't think he was going to make it. But he did. He beat the odds. But he's paralyzed from the waist down. Here he was, this great guy with this bright future, everything going for him. And now here he is, with his life ripped apart. It's such a waste. It was also senseless. What's this world coming to anyhow? Every time I think about it, I get sick inside. Sick. And damn mad. See him.